Oh my god, it's big. It's big, it's big, it's big, it's big. It's big. Stay down. He's running right at me. There's fish. There's another one right there. I just snapped off. That was a big fish. Oh, it's big. Come on. Be bigger. Oh my god, be bigger. Be bigger. Oh my god, it's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. Hold. Stay down. Stay down. Stay down. Stay down. No, that's not only. What's going on guys? Welcome back to another Dangling with Dev YouTube video. We're bringing back a series that you guys absolutely love, hunting for 10 pound bass. Guys, I'm kind of known, I'm gonna stroke my ego a little bit. I'm kind of known for being that friend in the group that catches big fish. And it honestly has been a while since I'm kind of getting right back into fishing after about a year off of catching big fish. The biggest one I've caught this year is five pounds, but you guys absolutely loved this series last year. I mean, we caught some absolute donkeys so we're going to be bringing it back springtime fishing here in florida it's like 68 degrees outside it was 40 i think 38 40 degrees this morning so the water temperature is really cold but they're going to start moving up on beds the place i'm at right now i've never fished before but i had a client who actually lives on the lake when i was meeting with him I asked him if he you know had ever fished it he actually used to fish in the bassmaster open really cool dude um he said he was walking around and he was seeing six seven and eights on beds last year hopefully we get on that today guys go ahead and drop a comment down below what the biggest bass you think i'm going to catch over this series is going to be we're going to do about five to ten episodes however long it's going to take it's all we're going to be doing no challenges no anything over these next couple weeks it's just going to be bang 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 you know what's going to come when i upload it's going to be big fish so without any further ado let's get to it you also you also might see me rocking this is a Guggen squad somewhere. Maybe, maybe you guys should go to GuggenSquad.com and buy a bunch of stuff and type in code DEV. See what happens. Just see what happens. Maybe you save. Maybe you save more than you thought. But you should just, just go do it. You know what I mean? It's not going to hurt anything. Just go try code DEV. See what happens. I'm going to put my extra rod right here. This water looks really, really good, actually. I don't see any beds at all right here. This place is so big. Pause. Pause, pause, pause. <gasps> I just got followed up. Oh, I legitimately got followed up. Wasn't terribly big. These fish are going to be kind of lethargic right now, but I have a red rattle trap on with the Alabama crawl bandito bug as the trailer. It honestly looks just absolutely insane in the water, if I'm being honest with you. Did y'all see that? Oh, I wonder if the camera picked that up. That was a very light colored bass. Oh yeah, they are fired up. Okay. Yeah, looking at this water, these bass are gonna be basically freaking white. He saw me and dipped. Nice. All right, so that's good. At least there's life here. <laughs> this dude is about to get kicked out. This dude just took a picture of my license plate. What's going on, man? Yeah, no, so I got, I have a client, I have a couple clients and I'm assuming you live in there? Yes. Yeah, so I have a couple clients in there. One of them is, I'm gonna turn this off. That dude just walked like a mile out of his neighborhood to where I'm at. Took a picture of my license plate just to say, <laughs> Hey, there's no fishing over there and in the future i have to be obviously like have to be with the person that gives you permission but it's a sunday and i'm not really going to bother random people you know what i mean it's not going to get any freaking bites in here anyway all right guys i am walking up to the first pond. i just wanted to show you guys what i got i got a 1.25 ounce chatterbait with a little trailer i left my tackle at the house and so i had to stop at this little bitty tackle shop and all they had was a ounce and a quarter jack camera i'm pretty sure it's like for redfish but since we are on a you know big bass mission i figured what's the difference so if i get a bite on this thing it's really just going to be an absolute giant what is what we're after that double digit bass guy just been so long i don't like 
I want to say like two and a half, three years now since I've caught one, uh, 10 pounds. So yeah, we're just going to keep, Oh, I've caught like an eight in, uh, in this little pond before. And because this is going to be heavier, it's going to run lower through all that grass. So hopefully I can just bring it by a big one's head and they just kind of turn on it. We got some absolutely insane, insanely weird weather. It's like super hot, but super high pressure right now. It's been extremely cold. So the fish might be like, hey, yo, my boy, what is we doing? Oh, there's a fish. Set the hook on down. Be big. Be big. Be big. Oh, okay. Come on. <sighs> Are you kidding me? I set the hell out of this hook. Oh, this fish is built so good. Oh, just absolutely choked it right off this point. Oh, why couldn't I do that to the freaking seven or eight? All right, guys. First fish of the day. Cannot. They fight so hard, Heather. Can't. Cannot. Cannot stress how important it is to get that skunk off the back. I was getting in my head, dude. The way he waked, I thought he was a giant. Check for phrase. The way he waked, I thought he was huge. I'm getting tore up by mosquitoes. There's a fish. Set the hook down. Oh. Oh, he pulled drag. Oh. Get him in. I'm not playing with these fish anymore. <laughs> Let's go, dude. Look how white this bass is. They just keep getting bigger and bigger. All right, I need to tighten my drag because this is a, uh, it's probably a three, 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 four, something around there. He pulled drag. So we're definitely going to tighten that drag up. All right. Watch the freaking bass come all the way out of the water over there. If I get hooked up, I'm actually gonna be in trouble right here. How you doing? Good, how you doing? I'm pretty good. Have you got a bite yet? I just got out here maybe like 10, 15 minutes ago. They they eat out here pretty good. You know what? I don't know about here. That one Which one? The, like this one? No, no. It's, uh, oh yeah, I know what you're there. talking about. With the other fountains? Yeah. With yeah. The, yeah. Uh, I think, uh, okay. I thought she was coming over to kick me out. Well, I'm coming over to say if uh, if anybody uh, called in that she didn't see me. <laughs> I did not see you. <laughs> yes, sir. No, you don't say that. I didn't see nobody. I got it. <laughs> All right, let's get kicked out of here really fast. Oh my God, is that a fish? I literally landed on a fish. Oh my God, this might be big. This might be big. This might be big. Oh my gosh. Stay down, stay down, stay down. He's running right at me. I can't tell. Oh my god, it's big. It's big, it's big, it's big, it's big. It's big. Stay down. He's running right at me. Nice. Beautiful fish. 
his mouth is wide open, made him feel bigger than he was. Oh, gorgeous bass. He was good. Wow. Wow. He was better. Jeez. I just snapped off. That was a big fish. That was it. That was. That was the one. Stay down, stay down, stay down, stay down. No, definitely don't lose him. Uh, no, he came off. No, 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 Probably, probably seven. I, I swear, I. Oh my gosh. Let's get back to it. All right, guys, that's going to do it for this episode of hunting for a 10 pound bass. It's really cool that we were able to get at least hooked up to one that was, that was up there, seven plus pounds. Um, I went back and looked at the footage. My arm was freaking blocking it. I'm sorry, guys. I was just in the zone. Wasn't really thinking. You guys didn't really get to see it. It was so freaking big. Go back and listen to the hook set. My line was just... Zzzz, it was, uh, 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 I'm going to freaking dang it Devin if you guys are still watching this video make sure you go to googlesquad.com guys check out the boys link the code it is back up and running code dev googlesquad.com I will link it down below make sure you follow me on Instagram dangle the dev all the fun stuff you know what to do also y'all might be seeing this right there there might be might be a little little merch game in the works it might be, might be live right now you know what I'm gonna link that down there too guys if you're watching this video just go check the merch out leave some reviews see what you all right the dog's yelling at me I gotta go catch you on the next video peace